Aloha friends, I wanted to share with you guys some new finds. I'm gonna call this new finds because I found this into my studio and I have not opened it. And you will be hearing Danica in the background because Danica is wherever I go. But um, new finds, some new items, but these are stuff that I just realized that I had. So I wanted to go ahead and share it with you guys. And I could have shared it before, but the fact that I have not opened it. So um, kind of new, new to me, new again. <laughs> okay, so we're going to start off with this. I've heard so much good things about this onto my, um, I belong to a couple of uh, crafting uh, Facebook pages. Um, this one is the 123 Punch Board by We Are Memory Keepers. Three punch boards. Um, it makes uh, cards, it makes bows, it makes uh, boxes. Here we go. Great for parties, uh, Valentine's gifts, birthday gifts, all that sort. It has a small, medium, large XL uh, box guide. And see how pretty. You can make it so that I've been wanting to try that. I saw this one as well. Uh, it's the grommet plier kit. Um, I love this. Um, I used to have one and then I lost it. So I bought another one and this is the one that I bought. But um, you can make grommets for like uh, curtains and shower curtains, regular curtains. Or I used it for making uh, grommets for like those excess um, materials that I needed for hula so that um, I can easily um, hang it and slide it. That's what I needed for the, the hula before. Crop a dial by Stampin' Up. And I don't know how much I purchased this for, but it was you know a while back. Multi-purpose punch and eyelet setting tool. Danica dropped something. This is a Martha Stewart Crafts uh, scoring board. And again, it's also to make like um, boxes and cards and envelopes and these little things. Score flawless crisp, li crisp lines and seconds, creative in invitations, envelope, gift boxes and more. Yeah, got that one. And then I wanted to share this with because I love this. I have this is my third one, so I have two small ones, and and then I bought a, a large one. And they, I bought them over at, at Joann's. They are the Ot Light, and the thing that I love about this is like when I'm doing um sewing in the middle of the night, or I'm doing my um Cricut or Silhouette, my cutting machines, and. You really need this light. This is a daylight. Um, it's not fluorescent. It's it's daylight, and daylight um, is so much better. And you can tell the difference of the lighting when you do photography, of course. But also um, when when you have to thread that needle, um, daylight is like the best because you can really see it. And I love mine. Um, this one's a tabletop. I have one that's um, taller if you've seen it in the studio. And this one is a folding cast lamp. So I love mine. I wanted to share that with you guys. This one, I've been, I've been looking for this forever. <laughs> I did not know where I put it. Project Life Photo Sleeve Fuse. So I bought this a few months ago. What it is, is like Project Life has those um, like memory keepers of like um, clear... Um, sleeves so sometimes the sleeves might be too big or sometimes you're using a sleeves that's like a one clear plastic sleeve you can use this to cut to um, to fuse together meaning to to bind together you guys know it more than me you know how I don't pronunciate and explain it well but um this is um, this is the tool to be able to um, to put like little sleeves of different sizes of however you need them to rather than one giant um, one giant sleeve see there's a better picture of it see she's um apparently it's like one one long sheet so she puts that in the middle and then this is the heating tool and then she's fusing it together so that it um it seals so then it becomes two right there's a lot of you guys that use this so I, I hope I'm explaining it right. So I bought this over at Michael's, 50% off. 
another pillow box punch board apparently I was looking for this and I couldn't find this and then so I bought this probably create your own pillow boxes so they're almost the same as that right are these pillow boxes mmm these are like straight boards or straight boxes but these are actually little pillows so I think they're different also we are memory keepers and this is way before my Cricut machines <laughs> and this must be years and years ago that I bought this this is Martha Stewart crafts I bought this over at Joann's I remember large circle cutter so this just cuts circles and now I have my Cricut machine or my silhouette I don't need these I just use the um, the cutting machine I love this one so this is my second one because I do have uh, an embossing tool already uh, from Stampin' Up. This is the Martha Stewart Crafts heating tool. I use this for making cards or embossing um, images onto boards or such. It, um, it gives out like a low, low heat and then you get these special powders. If you've never done embossing, you have these different, you know, colored powders. First you stamp it um, and then you do this the, um, the embossing powder and then you heat it and then it adheres to to the card so that's what that was for okay so moving on to my recent these are my recent purchase so let me just do this one so I bought this one on Michaels they were having 50% off in their Valentine's Day $8 so I got this for about three something because I also have military discount and Michaels I love shopping at Michaels and Joann's because they both accept military discount. Military at Michael's is 15%, Joann's is 10%. So then they have these clear stamps for Valentine's Day. It's pretty. Also, it's buy two currently until I believe Saturday. Buy two, get one free of their yarn. So this was $3.99, so I was able to get one free. And then this was a clearance box. This was normally $19.99. I got this for $5. And it's just a crate, like a wood crate box. That's all it is. I got that one. I love the color combinations that I picked out. I think it's very soft and subtle, um, very whimsical. I picked this out for either practicing uh, crocheting, something for the girls. And then um, this one I bought, even though I do have, you've seen it, the gray mat on top of my studio table. That is a protective cutting mat, but it's not glass. So I wanted to put this um, onto the white table when I do my, um, my heat press, my silhouette, my Cricut to do my HTV. I wanted to be able to cut it into something glass, not just the, um, not the pretty gray uh, cutting mat that I do have. So $8 that I got this for over at Michael's. These were a good find over at Hobby Lobby just last night. And I was so happy, so very happy to find, to find this. So let's go talk about this for Planner Basics from Create365. This is the rolling stamp, um, $4.99, 40% off. I never pay regular price. And it's just a rolling stamp. It says to do. It says um, top priority, important, you know, little sayings. And then this one is just a big stamp. And then it says important. And then it's got one, two, three, four, five little um, stars that we, you can put. So I wanted to get this because it was just, it was on sale. It's perfect for my, um, my happy planner that I have not shown you guys, but I am still currently using. Now this, oh my goodness, I was in heaven. Um, I, I have been looking all over for the Create 365, the Happy Planner, me and my big ideas, recipes planner. Friends, for two years. So $24.99 minus 40% off. It was the last one on the, um, on the shelf. So let me open this up and show you guys because I have not seen it as well, but I have been wanting it. Let me cut it. I have very, very limited light over in my, my house. So I wanted to um, give you guys a better look. So again, Hobby Lobby. It has the, um, the disc, the 
blue this that's very uh, pretty with the happy planner and then it has hearts I did not know that okay hearts then it has you know the it's the re it's this is the recipe organizer planner so just like the re uh, regular happy planner planners it has a very nice hard uh, binder <laughs> binder okay market list at the very beginning a couple pages of that then nice thing about this and this is one of the reasons one of the main reasons why I do love happy planner you guys seen my planners with Philo Facts and Erin Condren and I I love my Philo Facts but I also love um, the happy planner because you have you can buy the punch for these which I do have and you can insert pages in there you can take these out and rearrange or you can take um, you can um, you can create your own binder you can create your notes you can create your own papers your own inserts you can buy extras and all that stuff and that's what I love about it is that's very versatile this favorite recipe collection belongs to page okay cooking terms P to W puree to whip <laughs> to zest I don't know what P to W means but it has a little uh, definition of the most common uh, terms in cooking. Growing up, I learned life's important lessons at the dinner table by Chef John Besh. Okay, my very first time looking at this. Measurements and equivalents. Uh, family it has a section for family favorites, recipes, and it's a full page. So, difficulty, cook time, temperature notes. You you write it down, and preparation. So it has a couple of pages for that. Serve with. So that was the family um, section tab. And then this is the main dishes. Um, setting table. And then it gives you how the casual and the formal um, setting table. Slow cooker. I want to see that one. Laughter is brightest in the place where the food is best. Okay, it has cook time, high, low, notes, prep time, main ingredient, serve, serves with, rating, um, entertaining, let's see what that one has to offer, good cooks never lack friends, okay, so this one's entertaining, okay, and then healthy, okay, healthy fair, Prep, cook time, temperature notes, the same. Desserts. Okay. Mm, miscellaneous. Okay. So it's basically all the same, but then just they just tabbed it. They just put a tab of uh, separating it, but basically the same, um, same layout. And how much did I pay for this? So 24 minus 40% off. Let's just say I paid like $13, $14 for it. Not bad at all because one, it's a nice, nice size. You know, it's nice size. Two, uh, removable. So if you messed up or if you want to take it out and take it into the kitchen and use it and then you can easily put it back in. That's what I love about it. Um, like I said again, like the size of it. You can always take a picture of the dish. So this is what I would, you know, be willing to do. I can always take a picture of the dish or take a picture of the person that shared it with me, especially if it's from Nana or Grammy or Lola, you know, those people around us that um, that have taught us and we want to pass it on to the next generation. Then I want to make sure that, you know, it says it's from them. I want to take a picture of it, of them or picture of the dish or picture of them sharing it with us for like a Thanksgiving or like the family getaway that we had over at the mountains and then clip that picture in along with the recipe. And then this, this little $12, $13, however much I paid for it is passed on. I can keep this for many, many years to come. My daughters would use it. My son would use it. You know, that's the thing. That's why I've been looking for this for such a long time. And 
I cannot wait to fill this up with um, recipes from Pinterest that I that are my favorite, especially the cookies. You know, everybody's always asking me about cookies, and oftentimes I don't always. 99.9% .9 of the time, I do not always follow recipes. So I can note down in here of the little changes that I make so that when my kids make it or when the friends wants to make it, I can just easily say, okay, well, that's the recipe, but this is how I make it. This is how I changed it up a bit. This is the picture, so then I know what it looks like because I'm a, a very visual person. Overall, just looking at it and knowing that what its um, capabilities are for my own needs and my own wants, it is worth that $13, $13 that I paid for it. I'm so glad that I found this. Um, very thick, very heavy, sufficient enough, and lots of pages to where I can fill it for a lifetime you know, and share it, share it with friends and family. So um, if you guys are looking for this, you know, keep a lookout. Hobby Lobby, that's where I found it, okay? Mahalo friends, thank you guys for visiting me with A Simply Simple Life. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul of my crafts of new uh, new items and new to me, <laughs> new to me again items. As always, thank you. Mahalo.